You have entered the Plumbing Business Success Zone, teaching entrepreneurs the business of plumbing. This is Potty Talk Live, recorded live every week. Turn on notifications to never miss an episode. Now your host, Richard Bainey, the Million Dollar Plumber. Hey, 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 plumbing pros, welcome to the 309th episode of Potty Talk Live. I'm your host, Richard Bainey, the Million Dollar Plumber, along with my co-host, the lovely Laura, Hello. where we're talking the business of plumbing. All right, we have a great episode for you tonight. I can't wait to get into this one. Yeah? When do you fire your techs? <laughs> All right. Always one of my favorite subjects and times hey, in the plumbing hey, business. All right. Firing? Firing the techs. Okay. All right. Hey, we get this question all the time. When's, mm -hmm. when's the right hey, time or, or how do I fire my techs? When yes. do I fire my techs? All, okay, we get that question a lot. All right. We're going to go over that in this episode, so okay. don't miss it. All right. Stick yeah. around. But right now, hey, if you're checking in with mm -hmm. us here, check in with us. If you're watching live. You guys know what to do. You know, type live in the comments, all right? If you're part of the live hey, social baby. audience, all right? Good to have everybody here. <laughs> if you're watching the replay, mm -hmm. please type replay. Let us know you caught it. Hey, GB. <laughs> Good Aww, to see you, brother. GB. All right. <laughs> hey, and if you're listening to the podcast, <laughs> you know what to do. Just keep on <laughs> listening. <laughs> all right. Okay, so all Aaron right. said um, live this week. He's in Orlando. All those right. 59... <laughs> $59, ha <laughs> freeze breakout, um, got me a mini vacation, okay. yay, All right. I, I hope you're just kidding, Orlando. good. Orlando, it's been you, great weather too. All right. So, hey John, from Atlanta, live from Atlanta, yeah, everybody, good to tell have us you where, here, you're, John. Yeah. where you're checking in from, always love to see, to hear, you know, what, what part of the country, the world, That's might right. be checking in. Hey Sean. Sean, good Sean to have Patton. you here with us. Mm -hmm. All right. Happy Hi. Monday, baby. Hey, baby. Happy hey. Monday right back at you. Yeah. It was a good one, too. It was. It was beautiful. Yeah, it was gorgeous. All right. But we South weren't out Florida. in it. We were. We got well, Just a, for a little bit. Yeah. We were out in it for just a little bit. Well, we well, worked out this morning well, on the way back. Well, yeah. All right. We are in a brand new Jeep. That's right. Mm -hmm. With the top open. And, mm -hmm. oh, it was nice. Very Feeling those hey, nice, Joseph, cool breezes. It was nice. We do need to take right. the doors off, though. Yeah. And, okay, for those of you who are watching, probably some of you have seen that we did get a a new Jeep. toy. We new got a toy. toy. Um, very empty. Daddy got a oh, new toy. We should have a picture on there. Right. Shoot, should have done that. Um, but yeah, it's a Jeep. I know. All trip, I know. I feel, I feel like a little kid. It's you know, I know. But hey, Caleb, huh? we did find out that there's a Jeep wave. Yeah. We didn't know that when okay. we got a Jeep. I'm perfecting my Jeep wave. You got, you know, it's cool, you know. <laughs> You know? <laughs> yes. Okay. So, like Jeeps, when you pass each other, you're supposed to just kind of do a, a little yeah. wave. We say there's this whole this whole new sub subculture that we're now members of. Aaron, it's not too humid. Are you crazy? No. Where are you from, Aaron? All right, it's perfect here. It's, it's perfect. Perfect. That's right. And where did he say he's? A, I forget. Yeah. But it's not too humid. Hey, Chris. Um, but anyway, yes. Yeah, so we're learning the Jeep wave. All right. Mm -hmm. Right back at you. <laughs> All right. <laughs> but it's fun. fun. Lo loving fun. the Jeep. It's going to be fun. Uh, I'm not going to try to pronounce that name. I'm really sorry, but right. welcome from South Africa. All right. Welcome. Yeah. All right. Way down in South Africa. Good to have you here, man. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, so. we're, well we're going to be talking about um, how to or when to mm -hmm. fire your techs. Imagine <laughs> that. When do I fire plumbing techs? Mm -hmm. I guess that's the, the, the official title of tonight's, of, show. of tonight's show. Thank you, Sparky. Yes. All and right. it is um, the fourth part of a four-part Four-part series, Sermon all right. Series. Okay, right. Right. <laughs> that's, what that's what it feels like, <laughs> it right? Does feel like all it. right. We, we um, talked about how, how to hire, mm -hmm. okay, and you know how to train, how to train, okay. And we, we've talked about you know how to how, retain, how to how retain. To mm -hmm. and then the, the one thing we're all really nervous about. Mm -hmm. All of us go through this: mm -hmm. the firing, how to, okay. How and when to fire? In fact, it's one of the mm -hmm. biggest mistakes, mm -hmm. okay, that that we make starting out. <laughs> Wait until someone um, decks duck. you. Ducks you? Ducks, ducks you? you? Um, okay. You find your yellow duck on your Jeep. Someone may like your... I don't understand what that means. Okay. Duck, okay. A yellow duck on my Jeep? All right. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? I know. Is do, that do, bad? Do I want a yellow duck on my Jeep? I don't... <laughs> is it a dead yellow duck? <laughs> That's right. <laughs> <laughs> See, there's a subculture. We don't even know what that is. I know. It's is. crazy. But we're having fun. We're having fun. We're having fun. I feel... Somebody like, recommended putting like the eyelashes on the front yeah. Um, of the thing. Ah, I yeah. can't go with that. Okay. <laughs> All right. But we just go. might put that face. I think it could be fun. It. All right. Very fun. Mm -hmm. Fly the MDP flag, mm -hmm. you know. <laughs> put your All face right. on the Jeep. But it's fun. I feel I feel young. I mean, mm -hmm. that's a, guys my age, you know, we've had, you know, the sports car to <laughs> convertible. Most guys are my age, you know, getting the you know the sports, you know, convertible and all, mm -hmm. which is cool. That's fine. We, you mm -hmm. know. It's fine. But I feel, oh, good, you know, it's a good thing, John. We want the Jeep with the 
you know, it just yeah. feels, uh, you know. It's just fun. Floridian and yeah. beachy and, yeah, you know, I'm fine with it. Anyway. Yeah. You know, so, so, so look looking forward to it. Thing. Hey, question for you. Our question tonight. Mm -hmm. All right. How many people have you fired? Mm. Okay. What's in your wallet? <laughs> okay. How many people have you fired? Okay. Have you, have you gone? A lot of times, mm -hmm. guys, when we start our plumbing business, it, it, no one's really fired anybody. Yeah. I mean, been totally responsible for that. So mm -hmm. it's a big deal. When you start out. Okay. Sure. I also alluded to it's one of the biggest mistakes. Yeah, I want to drink a water here. My throat's yeah. a little, yeah. A little, little raspy there, baby. A little raspy. I don't know. Okay. Maybe getting the COVID or something. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, that's right. <laughs> you know, but it's all, it's one of the big big mistakes, okay, mm -hmm. that we make. Because he says one. Joseph okay, said yeah. one. Okay. okay, you had to go through that process. Mm -hmm. Okay, um, and one of the big mistakes we make is we don't fire. Okay, mm -hmm. we hold on to these guys mm -hmm. too long. Yes. Okay, a huge mistake. Huge mm -hmm. mistake. Mm -hmm. Okay, of holding on to the guys. Joseph says three. Three. Really? Joseph okay. Only three. All right. Wow. And, and I will tell you, I've, I've personally, I've, I've fired um, into the hundreds, <laughs> okay, more, more than I wanted, wanted to, to, okay? And it's never, it's never easy. In fact, mm. I want to say to you, I don't want it to be easy for you because mm. um, I want to keep your heart. So we'll talk about it. I want to keep your heart and that mm. kind of a thing. Right. But it's, it's, it, does get, it does get easier. Mm. I remember the first time I had to fire you know, one of my guys, <laughs> I was up all night mm. throwing up, practically, mm. you know, just so yeah. nervous, you know, that kind of thing. Because well, they're family and... John says zero. I've always delivered the news, and they fired themselves. You know, they okay, right. Like John. You know there is some truth to, to that. It. You know, I, I learned that if I just had the meeting, you know, like you know, write them up write for something, up, yeah. they, they wind up they wind up quitting within a week, anyways. They quit. Can't handle the burn. That's <laughs> right. Bacingo. You know, yeah. and that is you know, that, that there's a lot of truth to that. Mm -hmm. Probably at least five. Mm -hmm. Lance says. You know, another another mistake. Really? Um, I, I fired one. I fired one. Oh, yeah. Okay. 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 <laughs> I had to search my mind for yeah. that one. I remember now. <laughs> but there's, um, you heard of Sun Tzu? Sun Tzu. Sun Tzu. Yeah. Sun Tzu. Yes. Um, he was a great uh, military commander, mm -hmm. Chinese, which I, I kind of hate talking about Chinese stuff right now, but he was a great Chinese, <laughs> uh, Chinese commander mm -hmm. um, back about the, the 400 um, BC, okay, in, in, that, in that area. Okay. Okay. That's a long time so ago. way back there. Mm -hmm. Today, he's such mm -hmm. a great. It was a, such a great commander, and he wrote on you know military tactics and okay. commanding how to command the field, mm -hmm. um, how to command men. He was just a great leader. So okay, he was like a general, right? Okay, um, and so he, he wrote on that. In fact, in the military academies, study him to this day. Even though hey, Bo, even though that was written in four hundred BC, two thousand right. two thousand plus. Right, hey, Mikey. Right. Oh. So way back then. So there's just some you know two plus two two equals four. Mm -hmm. There's just some natural you know you step off a cliff you're gonna fall you know <laughs> that kind of there's just the things that just there's just some rat no matter what age you're in there's just laws of the universe and there's that, so yes and that's a great book it's called the art of war the art of war the art Thank of you. war the is art the of book war. by Sun Tzu. Um, small book. I mean, it's really. I, really I small. recommend reading. I think it's in the academy. Yes. I, rec I recommend mm -hmm. reading it. Certainly, mm -hmm. I, I like my clients to, to read it yes. um, because it's just even great. You know, we're talking about leading men. Okay, mm -hmm. but one of the it talks about um, it does talk about um, mistakes that that generals can make. Okay. Okay, and there's mm -hmm. just like four four or five. Mm -hmm. um, there are things like uh, hu hubris, being too proud. Okay. You know, too, I'm too proud, and you know you can you can trap a guy mm -hmm. in his pride. Okay, you can. Fire slow, fire you know, fast. Okay, mm -hmm. right. Mm -hmm. um, and so you can pull a guy in like that. Or um, some are too meticulous. They got to make sure that every I is dotted, mm -hmm. T is crossed. That would be me. I'm you know, general, and so they, they won't take me. the field. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's you know that can happen details, when we start our business. Details, right. It's just I won't you know I won't mm -hmm. put another truck out there. I won't hire. Mm -hmm. I won't do stuff. Things mm -hmm. aren't perfect. And then, I know I'm booked out for two or three weeks. Right. And but... I just oh, I'm scared. I want to move. That that's mm -hmm. a mistake. Mm -hmm. But one of the mistakes that mo I see of, of the hundreds of guys that I've spoken with of you know other business. Um, plumbing business owners, owners and, mm -hmm. and I've quite frankly I made this mistake myself too mm -hmm. um, is that we love our men too much hmm. we, we just love that we don't we want to keep them safe mm -hmm. okay we want to do 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 for them and so when it's time to send them into the battle mm. it, we just don't have the heart to do it mm -hmm. it just ain't, things aren't quite right whatever okay. we just never engaged 
okay mm-hmm. um and that that's a that's a big mistake love okay we, we, we love the men too much to the point of you won't fire them you won't fire them mm-hmm. okay even Which, though it's detrimental even though it's yeah it's killing business. your business right. okay mm-hmm. and it's hurting the other guys mm-hmm. all right mm-hmm. um and ultimately hurting you and your family right, right. but we won't we won't fire and it just comes okay. to that thing we kind of become like little you know high school girls you know i <laughs> i can change them you know i'll change them i know he's He's a bad boy, but I'll make him a good boy, right? <laughs> <Is that what? laughs> I don't know what, you know, okay? Or, you know, and we get a lot of marriages start out where it's mm-hmm. like, you know, well, I'll change him after we're married, right. you know? When we get married. When we're married, we'll, right. <laughs> It'll be perfect. All right. <laughs> we're setting the bar high this time for hiring employees. Good for you, Patrick. Good. The Singa, owner of Works Plumbing, Plumbing in San Francisco. The San Francisco Treat. treat. All right? Mm-hmm. So that's, you know, you... And we get caught up into that. Mm-hmm. By the way, your responsibility is not, um, another thing is, you know, we just, they have families. These are grown men, by the way. Right. I'm talking about grown men. Grown men. Yeah, if they're over 18, they're adults. They're, adult, they're grown they men. They really are adults. And so we start feeling bad. Well, they got, they got kids and, well, it's going to be Christmas in six months. What are they going to do? <laughs> you know, and why don't we get all wrapped up in all this emotion and that, mm-hmm. that kind of thing, mm-hmm. okay? Mm-hmm. And I just work with him a little bit longer. Well, he's only late sometimes. <laughs> yeah, I know he cussed out, you know, the CSR. Mrs. Jones. Or, right, he told <laughs> Mrs. Jones to stick it. But it was, you know, I talked to Mrs. She was kind of tough. You know, what, if we find, you know, all these excuses <laughs> not, not to do anything, yeah. okay? Um, because we feel bad for them, okay? When you're re- well, re- responsible, it... well, we feel responsible mm-hmm. for and to them. But is it that or is it too scared to fire? Well, it, the part of it, yeah, there is a little bit of, yeah. yeah Nervous right. about firing. There, you know, there is that. The confrontation or just, I mean, it's just not fun to fire somebody. Right, so. it isn't fun. Mm-hmm. But we also, a lot of times we come into this and we want, I'm going to create the best, you know, my guys, I'm going to take care of them. Mm-hmm. You know, we'll be buddies and all that kind of stuff. And it'll <laughs> be the best. It doesn't last. Right, it long. doesn't, right. <laughs> okay. When ultimately, and I'll, I'll tell you this, your response, you know, you're, you're not responsible for them, okay? Right. You're not responsible for your employees mm-hmm. and their lives, okay? Right. What you are responsible for is providing a safe work environment, mm-hmm. okay? Respect. Right. Okay. A good wage. A good wage. Mm-hmm. Clear expectations, yeah. okay? Crazy okay? idea. That, that's all you're responsible for, okay? Not for them to be happy mm-hmm. and, and to make sure that they understand that they're going to be there at 730. All they got to be is, under, you know, that, that you wake them up. You know, you call them. <laughs> Time to get out. All right, Joe. Please take a shower. Time today. to get out of bed. You know, right? You know, we're not the government. Okay, where well, we're going to tell you. Take a you know, shower. Wear a clean uniform. Right, and put the mask on. Okay, all right. So we're, we're, that is, that is not what we're responsible for. Okay. Okay. Got so it. yes. Okay, that's. There's a lot there. In fact, we mm-hmm. go over a lot of this in the academy. This is a big deal. This okay. Is, yeah. This firing. kind of thing, mm-hmm. and this is where a lot of guys lose their business. Mm-hmm. Okay, basically, you, you know, the guys start running them. Right. You start working for the guys. Right. And as soon as these pack dogs, and that's what they are. Mm-hmm. Okay. What is it? Um, the, what, the something's running the asylum. What's it right. called? Right. The inmates. The inmates are running the right. asylum. Okay. That's and it can sign. happen like that. Mm-hmm. Okay. Just like that. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yep. We as business owners, okay, what does it say? Oh. And managers truly don't mm-hmm. ever have to fire an employee. An employee mm-hmm. by their own actions fire themselves. Mm-hmm. Is that Jim Farmer? See? Well, there's a Jim Farmer. There's a Jim Farmer. I knew a Jim Far- we Farmer. Used to know a Jim Farmer. Yeah. All right. <laughs> um, but you, that's definitely right. They mm-hmm. do. They do fire themselves. Mm-hmm. Okay. But sometimes you got to push them out the door. <laughs> okay. You got to take them out back and shoot them. All shoot right. Them. <laughs> all right. Mm-hmm. You got to take them for a ride. Mm-hmm. All right. And grab the cannoli on the way out. Yep. Okay. Yeah. All right. So let's get to it. Oh, okay. I'm just gonna say something. Okay. You need to stop me. What? Nope. Stop nope. me. Nope. Stop you. Stop. Mm-hmm. Okay. Stop the lovely Laura. Is the lovely Laura gonna become the the tiger lady? <laughs> <laughs> Which she does show up every once in a while. I'm sure you know what I was going to say. But what's your point? Well, let's get to point let's get to one. let's get to the points. Okay, <laughs> when when do I fire a plumbing tech? Number one, below average plumbing skills. Okay, mm-hmm. pretty obvious, right? Okay, mm-hmm. but below plumbing, below, uh, average. B- below average. And the key word there is average. Okay. I want to focus on average mm-hmm. plumbing skills. Mm-hmm. They're never going to be as good as you. Okay, they're never. Okay, I'm not talking with you know that you hold never, this, this high ever, level. Ever. You know, Unless I, you were kind of a crappy plumber and you just wanted to have a right, business right. and you didn't then, want to be in the truck anymore, um, then, other than that, right. more than likely they're not going to be as good as you. Exactly. <laughs> we but, did have one client that's like, 
you know, I'm not that great. <laughs> I, I know. <laughs> I, 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 and I don't care. <laughs> I don't remember who that was, but I remember them saying And that. they wound up being, having a good business, okay? <laughs> right. I mean, that's, that's what makes a good businessman, <laughs> okay? But below average, mm-hmm. average plumbing skills. So, mm-hmm. you know, it's pretty obvious, you know, we, it's – I always say, you know, it ain't about plumbing, mm. right? So it's kind of the expectation that we're going to do the plumbing. Mm. So I don't care that you're, you know, that you say you're good at this or that, that kind of stuff. It's what, it's what we do. I don't want you spiking the ball in the end zone. Right. That's because you scored. That's what you get paid to do. Right. Shut up. Okay. <laughs> do All the right. plumbing. Right. Shut up. You know, you're dancing around because, you know, you're seven <laughs> foot tall and you can dunk the ball. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. Good for you. Yeah. All right. <laughs> okay. You know, so that's why we pay you millions. Right. So the fact that you go in and do a good plumbing job, don't tell me you did a good plumbing job because mm-hmm. that's what you get paid to do. You're right. a pro. I mean, that's, that's what it is. You're a professional. Okay. Be proud of yourself. Okay. Right. Hold, hold yourself to those standards. Mm-hmm. But the standards start coming down to where you're getting callbacks mm-hmm. for not, this, not necessarily bonehead things. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm-hmm. Bruce says we're okay. about to start hiring. Oh, good for Hire, you. Hiring. Good. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yes, it is. Jim. All mm-hmm. right. Good to see you, brother. All right. Um, and so mm-hmm. you never want, you know, if their skills come down, they're getting, if they're getting callbacks and mm-hmm. that, those kinds of things. Mm-hmm. All right. You know, not just bonehead stuff because right. bonehead stuff are going to, even the best guys do mm-hmm. bonehead stuff. Correct. Okay. Mm-hmm. All right. It happens. Right, Jim? <laughs> okay. All right. Okay. It, it happens. All right. Mm-hmm. But if they're get, constantly getting callbacks um, on basic things, okay, or making um, calls or decisions mm-hmm. on the job that just – you know, aren't up to standards, mm-hmm. okay? You can't, you know, you don't want to be, you're not in a position to train that, right. okay? In a service company, you don't want to be the one training. No, okay? especially Le- at the size most of our clients are. When you right. get larger and, you know, you're 15 whatever trucks, then that's it. If thing. you want, right. right. If, and if you want, right. that's, that's okay. the thing you can do. It, I wasn't looking for guys um, that, I, you know, I've never talked, I wasn't looking to talk plumbing or train guys on plumbing. I let, mm-hmm. I let Roto-Rooter and Ben Franklin train them. Mm-hmm. You know, let, let them spend the money and, and time doing that. Okay, and then sure, we and also, well, what? No, go ahead. Go ahead. I, I didn't want to spend the time training the plumbers. I okay, I wanted guys that were already able to able uh, to plumb. Agree. Okay, so that was the or expectation. We sent them to school. Yeah, we did. We did. Send, all right, <laughs> and let them learn how to plumb. Uh-huh. Okay, all right. And then they leave us to go to bigger shops. So. Anyway, all right. <laughs> okay, all right. Yeah, the lovely for, Laura got it. Got it in there. All right. Pay for four years of school, right. and they leave to go to bigger shops. But other off. than that. Well, that's a different issue. That's mm-hmm. okay. Know, that is that, a different, that takes us to the, a that show. takes us to the next next issue. Mm-hmm. Okay, yes. On why you fire when it's time to fire a tech. Okay. Character issues. Mm. Yes. Okay. Character, Character issues. issues. Okay. Should have saw that one coming. All right. Okay. <laughs> Character issues. Okay. Mm-hmm. And by character issues, I mean um, they, they can't get their butt out of bed. Okay. What you want uh, me to be on time? All right. You're supposed Every to be there. Day? Supposed to be here at seven, <laughs> seven thirty, whenever your your starting time is, mm-hmm. and they're they're always late. Okay. Mm-hmm. Those, those kinds of things. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm-hmm. Um, drama. Okay. Shop drama. 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 Okay. You don't need any shop. You don't need any drama queens. Mama drama. Okay. No mama drama. Mm-hmm. Okay. They just they just seem to cause problems in the shop. Right. Okay. Mm-hmm. Um, or they do. You know, on in front of Mrs. Jones, they do lose their cool. Mm-hmm. Okay. All right. In front of <laughs> that before. Right. Okay. You know, those kinds of things. Mm-hmm. Or they, they lose their cool, you know, and they're they're cussing out your CSR. Or say something inappropriate. Right. Or because they think they can get away with it. Right. Those right. kinds of things. Mm-hmm. Right. Okay. As soon as that I had had, had to learn. Mm-hmm. Okay. Again, you much rather walk walk through these guys. Okay, they're pack dogs. Okay. All right, they're pack dogs. Mm-hmm. Okay. And as soon as they know that they can bite you. They'll all turn on you. They're gonna. Okay, so as soon as they know they can get, as soon as they get away with something, mm-hmm. the whole they're gonna get away with it. Right. Okay, the mm-hmm. whole the whole shop will get away with it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Sean. What's, <laughs> what's the name of your company? We'll talk directly to them. <laughs> <laughs> right. Okay. Hey, look. There's just there's just a reality. I think I think our last episode we had a plumber on. <laughs> and talk, you can always tell the you can tell the business owners versus, versus the, plumbers, the plumbers, okay? Because right. the mm-hmm. plumbers will speak. And look, I'm proud to have been a plumber, mm-hmm. okay? I'm a master plumber, yes. and came up we came up that way. Mm-hmm. But for those of you to start your own business, there's a reason you're different. You're eagles, right. okay? Not a sparrow, okay? You're not a sparrow. Everyone else is, are sparrows, right. okay? Hey there, hey all right. James. So they flit around, they flit around the ground, okay? Mm-hmm. And, and together, and, and there's they, lots of sparrows, right? And it's okay, right. you, you know. There's God, God created sparrows. both, okay? Right. Mm-hmm. All right, but there's lots of sparrows, okay? So there's lots of plumbers. And they're near the ground, and that's all they see, okay? Mm-hmm. And that's all they're concerned about. Right. Okay, if you started your plumbing business, mm-hmm. you know, for your plumbing business owners, 
you know, you're an eagle, okay? You're soaring. You're up higher. You're seeing things differently, mm-hmm. okay? All right? And, and behaving differently. Right. Okay? Yes. All right? Um, soaring and seeing differently. Right. Absolutely. Okay. Um, I was going to say something else about an eagle, but I already forgot. But the character. Come to me. But character is a big. Character is a big thing. Is a, yes. is a big thing. Um, okay? In fact, mm-hmm. we, we talked about that, all right, that uh, that's how we hire <laughs> You know, if the guy said they knew plumbing, I took the word for plumbing. You're going to find out in the week anyways, mm. right? And if they're not, yes. you're going to move them on. Right. But you hire for character, mm-hmm. okay? And, and that, that starts from the first time they, they talk to, you know, your lady in the front right. office, mm-hmm. that and kind of thing. Coming in for an interview. Coming in for an interview, how they treat people. Mm-hmm. That's if an, they do like a, hey, baby. Right. Hey, yeah. it, it's gone. Okay. Yeah. In fact, like, <laughs> 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 I know. I just I don't want to go down that road. Okay. <laughs> but, but, but it's right. There's too many roads. But you, you're going to see it right. <laughs> but I hired on character. Mm-hmm. Okay. And, and that's what that's what you look for. Okay. Mm-hmm. All right. Okay. Char- character. Character is a big issue. Mm. Okay. Is that number two? In fact. Oh yes. Yep. That's yes. number two. Okay. In fact, that that's an important spec. <laughs> and building. Look how you did the okay. That, baby. And building a successful, <laughs> self-sustaining, and profitable plumbing business all right <laughs> and if that's what you're interested in doing all right you need to check out my million dollar plumber blueprint it's free it's free to you okay <laughs> all the specs are in there for you mm-hmm. to do just that okay to build mm-hmm. a successful self-sustaining keyword and profitable in fact very profitable plumbing business okay and if you're interested in that you can check it out again in my free Million Dollar Plumber Blueprint. Simply type free in the comments mm-hmm. or go to the million dollar plumber dot com forward slash free uh and grab your free copy. Without the A on the end. Today. Uh. <laughs> All, right. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So Yes. When do I fire plumbing techs? Mm. Okay, first of all, yes. below average plumbing skills. Okay. Gotta go. They gotta gotta go. go. They're out the door. Okay. Gone. All right, character issues. Mm-hmm. Okay. They're hitting on the CSR. Okay. They lie. They're late. All right. Flirting with the other guys mm-hmm. in the shop. They cheat. <laughs> right. They do plumbing they steal. jobs on the side. Okay. Mm-hmm. Those kind of right plumbing jobs on the side. Okay. That Can't that kind of that. stuff. All Can't right. Driving your that. trucks. You know, on personal stuff. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yes. All right. Always calling in sick. Those mm-hmm. those are character things. It's not your job to raise these you know, turn these boys into men. Mm-hmm. Sadly, most of these guys you're going to hire aren't men. They're boys. Mm-hmm. That's a sad state of effect. Yes. Fact. Sad. sad State, State of, of affairs, affairs in the U.S. of A. today, mm-hmm. not to mention the rest of the world. Mm-hmm. All right? There's more boys out there than men, okay? Exactly. And it's not your job. You don't want to be in the business of, you know, counseling these boys. If you do, <laughs> become a boy counselor, okay, or whatever. <laughs> okay. Is that a real job? <laughs> okay. What's the next step after you've read the blueprint? Well, James, stand Stick by around. one second. <laughs> right. In about five minutes, we're going to tell you. Get right. a pen and paper ready. Right. Okay. Here we go. <laughs> we do know. <laughs> right. Do we pay him to say that? That's right. <laughs> right. James, make sure right. you're here at every show because That's that right. was perfect. <laughs> Thank you, brother. Okay. But finally, we get to three. Mm-hmm. The piece de resistance. Are we saying that right? Piece, piece de, de resistance. resistance. It's French. I know. French. Need... Oh, the French. <laughs> the French. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Number three. For us. You're right. They'd, They'd be, be speaking German. <laughs> All right. All right. Refuse yes. to follow your program. Hmm? Biggie. Guys, you what got you, mean? you gotta you gotta decide. <laughs> are they working for you? Or are you working for them? Hmm? Now there's a thing with listening, okay? All right. Yeah, I, I hear you, Jim. Yep. All right. All right. All right. Get out there and take him take care of Mrs. Jones. Mm-hmm. All right. Um but not following your program, like what? Like not giving options? Not not giving options. Walking away. W- walking away, right? Not 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 doing your routine, okay? Mm. Uh, right. Certainly don't, you know. They go off in their own tangent. Mm. Um, just decide what jobs they're going to take. Decide they might do T and T and M instead right. of flat rate. Right. Just, yeah. just kind of writing things pull, up. When, right. Price right out of there. Instead of when you, when you have, you know, you price. have the flat rate, you know, mm-hmm. task there for them right. already. Mm-hmm. Uh, just deciding they're doing their own thing. Mm-hmm. Don't like your pricing, that kind of stuff. Guys, as soon as you get a whiff of that, pricey, okay, yeah, I mean, it's, it's, it's just it's disrespect, mm-hmm. okay? And in, in my years, okay, of, of dealing with men and certainly with, with my business, mm-hmm. as soon as you lost respect, I never was able to get it back. Mm-hmm. No matter how friendly I was, I'd be their buddy. Oh, come on, we're in this together, <laughs> you know? We're in this together. <laughs> come on, let's, let's do this together, mm-hmm. all right? No, they're not, okay? They're doing their own thing, okay? Mm-hmm. Never... Um, no matter how many uh, trips we gave, no matter how many <laughs> meals we did, 
how many <sighs> you know schools we paid for right it doesn't it doesn't matter mm -hmm. okay they're gonna do their own thing mm -hmm. all right there is no loyalty okay mm -hmm. we're starting doing that and it's working out really well starting doing what right um which part <laughs> right. that's all good advice right right um tickets have oh with a are you in the success academy bruce tickets oh, yeah. have doubled yep sweet yeah love hearing that um I'm coming back. Yeah, if I'm more. working. Yes, you are, Bo. You're, you're turning right. things around. Can you see there? I got some emotion here, Bo, with this, because this is a big deal. I, sadly, I see, look, I spent, uh, I think the blessing is that Laura said, you know, for years I tried to, you know, talk to my guys like they were, we were on the same level. Mm -hmm. and or try, they were, or they trying were business to owners. Business owner and lift mm -hmm. them up and give them the information mm -hmm. and talk of that. And, you know, and Lori used to say, you know, we see the guys, they would listen because I signed, you know, the front of their check, mm -hmm. you know, and, but they're really, they're drooling, their mm -hmm. eyes are rolling back in their head, you know, mm -hmm. that kind of a thing. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, but today, this job. is kind of my blessing. And we, never expected, we never expected to be doing this thing, mm -hmm. you know, the you know, whole potty talk live, million dollar plumber, uh, mm -hmm. that, you know, and coaching, coaching. you know, mm -hmm. you know, and, you know, having, you know, so many, you know, a lot hundreds in the success academy mm -hmm. a private coach you know how many clients, clients right mm -hmm. um literally and talking to people all over the world mm -hmm. um and so this turn is really the blessing is i now get to talk to guys that are starting their own business right and want the information and want, hungry hungry for the hungry right for and, their, that information. and we'll do it because right. they're eagles okay exactly. and they're eagles mm -hmm. but we have spent time and this is what i don't you know we often say of course we can tell you what to do, mm -hmm. okay? The, the, the equations and those kinds of things are mm -hmm. easy, okay? Mm -hmm. All right? What, but not making the same mistakes, yeah. <laughs> okay? Mistakes we say made. don't make the same mistakes we made. And right. a mistake that I made mm -hmm. um, for many years and even would come back to it because you fall in that trap, you know, you love your guys mm -hmm. too much, all right, is this idea of just, um, you know, just kind of working with them and trying to mm -hmm. build them up and, right. you know, educate them on why you charge what you charge right. or, you know, mm -hmm. this is why we do this and mm -hmm. that and that kind of stuff. Right. And nope. it just. You, you just have tons of money, Mr. Business Owner. You're right. Just, you're rolling around in money because you own a business and, yeah. Right. That's, okay. I I, if I could do that with, with you guys and reach mm -hmm. for your, you know, plumbing business owners, reach through the camera here, mm -hmm. you know, and just kind of grab your shoulders. Don't make that same mistake. Exactly. Okay. All right. Mm -hmm. You know, fire. Uh, fire quickly. I think someone put that in. That yeah. is part of a saying. Hire you know, slow, fire hire slow, fire quick. You know, mm -hmm. I would say hire on character. We're always recruiting. Yeah. Okay, it's always hard. So recruiting. always recruiting. Mm -hmm. Always, always. So mm -hmm. we're gonna hire, hire on char character like now. Mm -hmm. Risk with that. Right. But fire as soon as these we have these things. Okay, mm -hmm. the, find out their work is below average. Below average, not right. you. Right. Below average. Mm -hmm. They can't do the basic. You know, basic stuff. Okay. Right. All right. Character issues. Mm -hmm. All. You know, honey, it's amazing. You know, I've had guys. We hire them, mm -hmm. and I've had, literally had in my office crying when I hired them. I was like, this is great, it's a work <laughs> all day, and I love you, and all that. And <laughs> literally a week later, I'm the biggest D. Jerk. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever, you know, it's like, because I expect them to be there, mm -hmm. <laughs> you know, I expect them to keep their truck clean, mm -hmm. and to work my program, mm -hmm. okay? <laughs> what a jerk. Yeah, right, right, okay? <laughs> and so that leads to, you know, they refuse to follow your program, mm -hmm. Okay. They All right. It's like um, um, a football team. Right. Right. The coach has got plays. You send the, the players out onto the field, and what would happen if the players all of a sudden say, eh, right. I'm not going to listen to to that coach. I'm not going to follow you know his the plays <laughs> or whatever. We're going to do whatever we want. GB's a fire. Yes. Had fired one guy because he had stopped to do a side job before going, <laughs> going to, to eternity he, he, he job. <laughs> and, he, and he got there late. And he got right, 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 right. <laughs> See, I'll guy, be just a little late. I got right, a little, right, right. little errand I got to run. You know, <sighs> I've seen, I've seen it all, man. I'll use your truck and your tools and your right. parts. Look, and it's not your job to again to to raise, you know, make men out of these boys. Mm -hmm. Okay, um, give you, an opportunity. If you've got someone that's hungry. And that's right. part of it, the character issue too. Um, are they hungry? Are they really? Are they um, coachable? Right. If they're coachable, then they're then you can work with them. But the guys right. that are just you know kind of know it alls and. Oh, I mean, I have guys coming to you know they come in the business, and I, even with the clients, we hear this where they come in and they want to tell you how to run your business. Yeah. <laughs> you know, it's like what, what. Huh? Huh? <laughs> it's like get the get in the right, you know here's the door right you know and so you notice i i didn't mention anything about money about mm. how much money they made mm -mm. i mean we had guys that weren't I mean, this isn't about you know now they can't lose your money the truck it can't be the asset oh, sure. mm -hmm. can't be losing your money right. okay but 
you know, I've, I fired guys that made the most amount of money mm. and even, even pushed them on. I lost, mm-hmm. you know, some, some of the best guys because I wasn't I wouldn't going to change our game mm-hmm. for them, right. okay? Mm-hmm. What wasn't going to set that precedent up, Correct. you know? Mm-hmm. So it's not necessarily about, it's not about the money, Mm-mm. okay? No. Nope. All right? So what's going to be best for the, the company and the team overall. Right, mm-hmm. exactly. Okay. Okay. So, so there we have it. There we go. How to so, fire. So I, I bet you right now in your shop there's someone needs to be fired tomorrow morning <laughs> is there okay mm-hmm. um you know and you'd be surprised when you get rid of that cancer mm-hmm. how the rest of the shop will work smooth for a while <laughs> okay <laughs> <laughs> you know, there's just something that happens <laughs> you know I, i've told you what's the scene from master and commander you know the one where they have to to cut the guy loose because oh, it's a long story well they're in the storm or whatever mm-hmm. and the guy you know the, the ship mass falls over and takes one of the guys, one of the, one the, of the guys with him, right? And mm-hmm. now the whole the mass is working as a as a, a sea anchor. Okay, it's pulling the ship over in the mm-hmm. storm. And the the shipmates all tied up or in the cords and whatever. Right. Right. Well, and there, he's now going swimming. He gets loose, but he's swimming. But you know, you can't you can't get there quick enough because mm-hmm. they they got to cut the got to cut the the mast off. Right. right. To let let and that was a guy they they liked. Mm-hmm. You know, because it saved the ship. But if they didn't cut the mast, what was going to oh, happen? Oh, the whole ship would it, everyone would have been lost. Right. And that's what happens when you have these these mm-hmm. bad guys on your team, okay? <laughs> Thank they want, you. Or they, or want they want to become right, right. partners. Right. No. Okay. No. 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 We're going to do a whole show on that. Yeah. Don't ever take on a business partner unless it's no. your wife. Yes. That is the only way. Only way. Hey, Chris Copeland. Um, I saw you guys had date night. Good for you. Yeah. Um, the boss was just telling me this today about one of our guys says he's trying to run the business. Um, the boss being Mrs. Copeland. Yep. <laughs> yep. You, you can't have that because soon, as soon as one of the pack dogs, mm-hmm. okay, feels they can bite you or they, they, can, they can scare you or manipulate you, mm-hmm. you're done, man. Mm-hmm. You're done. They smell it. They, they smell it right. Mm-hmm. Okay. And so don't make the mistake that I made multiple times mm-hmm. by holding on guys too long, trying to work with them. Okay. Mm-hmm. Um, as years after, you know, near the end there, I, you know, got better at just, you're on, you know, mm-hmm. done with you kind, kind, kind of a thing. Move okay. On. These are grown men. Okay. Yes. So, and I get it. It is emotional. So mm-hmm. if you're going through that, I don't want to, you know, but, but as your big brother, okay. Well, you don't want to what? Well, I don't, you know, I don't want to just beat you on that because I want you to keep that emotion because that's part of the responsibility, mm-hmm. uh, the privilege of being, um, the business owner responsible for other people mm-hmm. okay and you are responsible remember as the business owner you're responsible for everything you've often heard me you know mm-hmm. talk about that everything is your fault everything is everything your fault. is your fault mm-hmm. okay so even the job that goes south is your fault right. okay it's take the bug stops it's, it's right with you okay mm-hmm. take on that responsibility mm-hmm. but i want you to care you know for these people mm-hmm. okay <laughs> okay an ap uh, no. <laughs> notice Patrick. No, no, <laughs> time, time piece. piece. All right. No, it's a watch, Patrick. It's, it's a watch, just a watch. watch. No, it's a time piece. <laughs> I learned from Patrick. Patrick Basinga. Okay. <laughs> There's a time piece. Right. Patrick has class. Patrick does have class. Okay. Mm-hmm. And, He's a uh, and so guy. he did uh, kind of class me up a little bit and talk to me about uh, no they're not time cl- piece. right they're time pieces uh-huh. so yeah I got a nice I got a you got you got me hooked man I got I got a few nice time pieces now okay hey, Matt Carter huh. so nice when um, you get rid of the cancer mm-hmm. hey brothers right on yes, true. yes it is that. okay speak to, from experience on okay that one as so well. you have a responsibility to your whole crew mm-hmm. so that everyone has a a safe um, um, and is held accountable under the same rules right okay. You know, so when they see someone else can get away with something and mm-hmm. they're getting away with it, you know, it's, then everyone becomes bad. Right. So it, they, a bad apple doesn't raise, make all the other apples new. good, you know, or the good apple doesn't raise the bad apple right. and up. And the bars and, keeps going lower Right. And That's lower what happens. Like, oh, yeah? how fair does it feel? <laughs> he got you know, away with that? Right. Watch this. Right. <laughs> like, we couldn't get, you know, you couldn't get your hair done, huh? but, but Nancy Pelosi could get her hair done. Oh. Okay. You know, they can open up the shop and they can do that. Oh, they can got, not, they cannot have to my hair right. done, trust me. <laughs> right. <laughs> but, Let's be right. Clear. but it's it's that you know how that feels? I just mm. use it, you know, that, that double Or um, right. one of the governors, you know, goes out to a dinner. Right. They they, they can go out to dinner, but right. but the rest of us can't. Mm-hmm. Well, because they're you know, they're better than us. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm-hmm. Well that's what happens in the shop. Mm-hmm. Okay, so you have a guy that's getting get away with stuff, that, uh, prima donna that's mm-hmm. being allowed to get away with stuff mm-hmm. and this kind of has a sense of controlling things and talking, mm-hmm. you know, and all that kind of stuff. <laughs> it doesn't raise the rest of the guys up. Right. You can, even your best guy will wind up lowering your guys. Right. You know? Absolutely. I, you know, I've had shops that, that just, you know, went south 
because I kept the wrong guys, mm -hmm. guy or guys on mm -hmm. too long and it lowers everybody. Right. Okay. Mm -hmm. Everyone gets a bad attitude. So yep. that's what happens. So okay. cut that cancer out. Okay. So think about it tonight. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Go go in tomorrow morning and just fire somebody, okay? <laughs> Sometimes it's just good to shoot somebody, okay? It puts a fire in everyone else's butt. <laughs> don't, don't let it be yourself. Okay. You fire yourself. <laughs> right, right. You know, sometimes it's good, okay? <laughs> all right? So, that, so they know that you're in command, all right? Sometimes you got to make an example of somebody, mm -hmm. okay? So, okay. <laughs> right. <laughs> Everybody's going to go. Right. Fire. Right. Well, Richard said. Right. Yeah. <laughs> got to fire somebody. Hey, I'm, I'm, I'm only half joking. <laughs> I know you are. You know, because I know I talk to a lot of these guys. <laughs> hold on to guys for two. You know, long. hold on. Right. Yes. And it's amazing. Well, look at everyone on your crew and then kind of go through. Do they have character issues? How's their plumbing skills? And are they following my program? Right. Right. If they're not. You're out of here. Okay. Don't. So, you know, all right, take all them right. out back. So, the last part, the, the last of the four part series. We have another series coming up, too, don't yeah, we? Yeah, what, what do we have I coming up? We do have another four part series, and it's huh. really, really good. It's going to be really, really good. <laughs> <laughs> I remember, we, just, we plan huh. by Talk Live in a few months in advance. Or if we probably plan that one out on the boat <laughs> with a few adult beverages, yeah. if I can. It's so, gonna it's probably going to be really good. good <laughs> All right, there you go. Okay. <laughs> All right. Mm -hmm. Don't, um, you know, as, as the song says, mm -hmm. let him go, let him go. <laughs> no, I, right? that's how it goes. But you know what they're singing and dancing around? The, let him no, go. Let, no, it's, there's ice and snow oh. and something. I, I thought that's what they were singing. Let him go. No, let it go. From Frozen? Yeah. No, let it go. Let Not it go? Him. Yeah, let it well, go. In our, let him go. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> let him go. Okay. <laughs> All right, there you have it. Just frozen. <laughs> frozen. Oh, I just lost uh, my man card. I have a daughter. I have a daughter, okay? That was one of her favorite movies. That's right. All right. Uh, how do you pay yourself? Um, same as the guys, piecework? James, are you are you still in the truck, man? As the owner? Let's get your butt out of the truck. That's the first Okay, step. right. If you're still but, in the truck. No, you don't pay yourself piece rate. You're, okay. you're the owner. All right. You get paid. Okay. In fact, if you want to learn how to pay yourself, <gasps> you need to check out my Million Dollar Plumber Success Academy. Just who where we got asked. Before, okay, what? Mm -hmm. where you, you go? Okay. Oh, yeah. okay. Yes. All right. Everything you this need is to know. The next step after the blueprint. To run your plumbing business, okay? Mm -hmm. There's guys that come out of business school that don't know they can't couldn't run a plumbing business. Couldn't run, mm -hmm. they can't run business. Right. Here I, I tell you everything you need to know to run your plumbing business successfully okay how to have a successful self-sustaining okay that's key right there self-sustaining and profitable plumbing business mm -hmm. okay and it's all delivered to you in 12 easy bite-sized modules mm -hmm. over 150 videos sessions it's a okay wealth of information, everything from sure. how to pay yourself how to mm -hmm. pay your guys how, how to, to market brand, how to make the phone ring. it's all there for you okay right oh. now you can check it out for free mm -hmm. 14 day free trial. So I hook you. That's exactly what I do because once you get in there, you're hooked. That's right. Okay, type um, success in the comments or go to the million dollar plumber.com forward slash success mm -hmm. and grab your free trial. Okay. All right, time to go. But as always, I want to remind you that you're perfectly and wonderfully created and you were created to do great things. Oh. So come like a champion. Thank you for tuning in to Potty Talk Live with Richard Bainey, the million dollar plumber. If you enjoyed this show, share it now. Just do it. To catch past episodes and get alerts for new episodes, turn notifications on now. And join us again for more tips, techniques, and strategies to help you grow your plumbing business.